Hey guys, so we are here with a bit of a pig update for you. Uh, as you can see, you had to get away from me. You guys are getting huge. Uh, and two of them are now very much pregnant. So uh, at some point in the next week here, we're expecting some bunch of piglets on the way and it could be anywhere from 10 pig piglets a piece maybe. So we could have 20 piglets running around here uh, by the end of the week. Crazy how much they've grown up already. I'm watching my toes for a minute. I don't want to get stepped on either. Hey. Don't wear flip flops when you come to a pig tent. Okay, so we are back here today. We had one of our local arborists drop off a bunch of wood chips. So, oh no. I'm trying to push the babies out. Um, we had one of our local arborists drop some wood chips here, so we're gonna get those into the muddy areas. Uh, just when these piglets do come out, they're not gonna get stuck in this mud. So, uh, just make it a little drier and safer for them. So, we knew this day was coming for a while, but uh, first piggy's out. I don't know how mama's gonna be with me this close here, but. Unfortunately, it looks like we have one stillborn uh, in there and one alive so far. So still more to come, but uh, first one's out. And this is one of the things you have to be careful about is mom, mom stepping on them. Apparently that's not uncommon, so. It's okay, mama. It's okay. got milk dripping out of her udders already and that's the first little piggy cute colors but one stillborn there I'm sure she's gonna get back to laying more but I'm gonna make a quick phone call and ask what I should do uh, about that because I'm glad I got that other fence gate in there just in time so I can separate those other pigs while all this is going on here okay check back in soon Okay, so we're back. There's still one live one out, another one uh, that's still in the sack. I was told just to leave that one if I try and take it out of there to help her. It's probably just going to get her more riled up and call more issues. So, um, yeah, she's burrowing in there again. So she just laid down and got up again. So apparently they'll lay one at a time, uh, clean it up, and then have another one so we'll see if we can catch one coming out here but that first one is super cute I like the colors so one baby is just buried in the grass there she's put under there to protect her I think and these pigs keep trying to break through this gate so that's why I have to stop filming there to try and keep these guys out get get out get out oh this is so exciting we've been waiting for this for so long oh she's down again She's tired and she's only had two. There she goes. Oh, I see a tail. Come on, little buddy. 
she was squirming, so. Oh, and these pigs are in. Shit. Come here. Come on. Come on. Come here. Come on. Enough to fortify that better. I still think I've got food. Come on. Come on. Suckers. One more that just came out there. Coming up quick now. Oh my gosh. Come on guys, get out of the way. More coming. So we're now at uh, six out, five healthy, one not so much. Good job, mama. Yeah, she knew it was coming. This is uh, most of them sleep in that big uh, half container over there. And when we got in this morning, she had moved all this grass on her own into uh, into their old little sleeping hut here for them. So I can't believe they brought, that she brought this much grass in to prepare. Kind of cool. Guys, welcome to the world. Steph's going to be so upset she missed this. That's what you get for not helping in the big pen. Yes, this is her first, uh, first time having babies, so we're not sure how many she's going to have here. But uh, yeah, like I said, we got uh, one, two, three, four, five out that are healthy and moving around and trying to nurse. and. Uh, one was a stillborn, the first one, so we'll see uh, how many more we get here. Oh, there's another one. That one also looks like maybe not. No, oh, that's too bad.
Yeah. It's not sad. I may quickly go and uh, get my gloves from the car here and just move that one out of the way and see if it upsets me or not. If it does, I'll just leave it, but who knows? If we open that up, maybe it'll be fine. And I'll get my gloves and see. So there's a lot of discharge that came out of that last one that still looks like it's in the sack there. So uh, I don't know how I'm going to film this and try and do it at the same time, but I'm just going to pull it out and see if I can break that open and see if that maybe does something. But if it starts upsetting mama, then I'm just going to leave it. break this open. I don't think it's going to be live anyways, but no. No, I don't think so. Hey, buddy. Poor mama just seems so exhausted. Well, she hasn't had one in a while now. There's uh, five healthy ones out, two stillborn, seven. So I would guess there's still some more coming, but uh, I don't know. They're all bundled in there. No, I know, Mama. She's a poor girl. She's got her head shaking in there. Especially two, because the first one, maybe she's done. The first one that came out was a stillborn. And then the last one, the seventh one that came out was a stillborn. So maybe, uh, maybe that is it. I would have thought she'd have about 10, but uh, who knows. Well, so like I said, that's um, seven out, five of which are alive and healthy. She hasn't had, uh, had one in about 10 to 12 minutes here now. So, oh, as I said that, never mind. I was just about to say maybe I'll call it a night. And unfortunately, that looks like another stillborn. Oh, poor mama. Three stillborns. I'm guessing with, uh, like I said, the first stillborn was the first one out. And then number seven and number eight were both stillborn, so I'm guessing if they do have any more now, they'll be stillborn too. So I'm going to put the phone down. I will uh, just check that one as well and break the sack, but that's probably another one that's not going to make it here. I was just dealing with the, the last stillborn, thinking that would be it, and another healthy looking one just popped out so what's that put us at six uh six healthy ones three stillborn so far hi little guy Cough it up. There you go.
cough it all out, buddy. There you go. There you go. I love the color of these ones. are all buried up in her head now. Everyone on the island comes to feed the pigs. How's it going? Okay, we got some little piglets. Yeah. One of them did. He doesn't look quite as awake as the other one, but he took a breath there. There you go. Come on. No. She sounds like another one might be on the way. eight little piglets now so not sure if he's done enough but uh, three have not made it and we got eight happy healthy looking pigs 
A whole bunch still have their umbilical cords all attached dragging around, but... Okay, well, eight healthy babies. Unfortunately, like I said, we had three uh, three ones that didn't make it, but uh, I think that's it. I'm not sure why I think that. I think the rest of her placenta has come out there at the end, so I think that may be a sign it's over. I think that's her placenta anyways. I'm such a guy, huh? Okay. Well, that's it. It uh, feels weird leaving them here, but it's starting to kind of get towards dusk out here. The other pigs are starting to lay down, so we're going to call it a day and we'll be back in the morning. Okay, so we're back here the next morning and uh, all eight little piggies seem to be doing well. We got Mama some food here because she's kind of cut off from the other one, but uh, all are happy and healthy and looking good. So. Too bad uh, that three unfortunately didn't make it like we said, but uh, eight happy healthy ones for our first litter. We're pretty happy with that. Cute. Okay, so we're back. We just checked in the other piglets this morning, and uh, the second mom has put a bed together here of grass, which is uh, exactly what the the first mom did right before she uh, had her baby. So maybe today, if not tomorrow, we'll have uh, another set on the way. Okay, so it's back here the next day. We've got Mama distracted with some food and uh, the second mom has had her piglets as well. So, got more cuteness here. All looks happy and well. Um, didn't see any stillbirths with this one, which is nice. Um, so yeah, we're gonna go check on the other ones and see how they're doing, but uh, it's more happy, healthy piglets on this side. Okay guys, so uh, unfortunately on the first set of piglets, we have another two that uh, that didn't make it. And we're not showing this to be gruesome or anything, but if you've been following along with our journey, you know we try and be kind of honest and open about everything that's happened and, and not just show the good things. So um, this is one of the unfortunate realities that sometimes they get stepped on or, or just don't make it for, for whatever reason. So um, two of the original litter didn't make it and we're down to six. So we're just gonna take them home um, and bury them. We don't want the other pigs to eat them and kind of get the case for that or anything so uh, we're gonna clean them up looks like they've already kind of taken a bite out of one unfortunately but we're gonna pick these guys up and take them home and uh, the other six look like they're doing okay so hopefully the rest of them will, will all be all right Mama's just feeding. She'll be back to, to keep them warm soon, I'm sure.
All right, guys, that's it for this week. We hope you enjoyed uh, following along with this new experience for us. Hit subscribe and like below, and we'll see you next week.